watch for that wind. Yeah, the wind and uh, not too bad uh, into uh, Wednesday, Thursday morning. After that, the plot thickens around here. We've got a big storm that's going to chug its way across the country. Let's uh, check outside right now. Uh, we have a band of clouds coming through, a little bit of lake effect cloudiness here. This is up in Malta by exit 12. The breeze still kind of whipping around at times. We've got gusts 25, 30 around the capital region today. Current temps, upper 20s to low 30s. A little bit colder up there at Lake Pleasant, 25. Coble Skill at uh, 27, 29 at uh, Manchester. Let's check in with the uh, News 10 weather watchers. Uh, Jane Williamson in Indian Lake, uh, 25 right now, 29 in Queensbury. Bob Weinford up there in Whitehall, 32, and Jim Delahanty in Hebron reporting in at 28 tonight. Out to the west, uh, some flurries and snow showers. Out towards Caroga Lake and Gloversville, Hessville at 30, 26 right now in uh, Dwaynesburg, Jim Glockner in Greenfield Center, 29. Near freezing from uh, Waterford down to Delmard. Uh, John up there in Grafton, 25, 30 at Bennington, 28 um, in North Adams. Bill Mahone in Lanesboro, 28, and Ronnie up there in the hill in Windsor at uh, 24. He's way up at 2,000 feet. Uh, summer tonight, uh, Don Clark, uh, 24, 26 in Wyndham, and near 30, 31 from Germantown over to uh, Hillsdale. Now, let's show you the uh, radar. We've got a band of flurries and uh, snow showers continuing to persist. They are moving south, southeastward, out through Otsego County, southern Schoharie County in particular. There seems to be a few heavier snow showers around uh, Gilboa and uh, Conesville. And a pretty good snow shower still in southern Vermont. Southern Green Mountains now east of Bennington, especially south of Route 9. These are sliding southeastward. A uh, quick half inch of snow and some gusty winds. High pressure building in for the short term. That's blocking this moisture to the south of us. This little storm is weakening off to the west. It's this storm off the west coast. I know it's a long ways away, but that's the storm that's ultimately going to impact our weather here on uh, Friday. Future cast, let's skip ahead to Thursday. Skies cloud up, moisture to the south of us. And there's the big storm. Blizzard conditions in the western Great Lakes and the upper Midwest as this storm charges up through Michigan. So we'll get uh, a brief mix, then rain Thursday night. Friday, it changes to all rain with a very strong south wind, maybe some heavy downpours. Then the cold air wraps in behind it. Uh, it may end as a quick little burst of snow. And that Arctic blast is going to chug its way east, would arrive here Friday night and be right over us for the upcoming Christmas weekend. Looks windy, number one, and very cold temperatures only in the 20s. Highs tomorrow around freezing, 32 in Albany, 33 Glens Falls. Pittsfield 31, everybody close to 30, 32 degrees. And for Wednesday, about the same. 30 at Saratoga, 31 Johnstown, Great Barrington 35, and 30 at Glens Falls. All right, let's recap the uh, forecast for tonight. A uh, couple of spots getting that snow shower, otherwise becoming partly cloudy, a low near 23. Tomorrow becoming partly sunny. It's going to be a chilly day, a high near 32. Seven day forecast, first day of winter on Wednesday, partly sunny 31, 15 at night. Clouding up Thursday, could be a mix towards evening 38. Rain and wind Friday, 53. May end as a little bit of snow. Windy and cold for the Christmas weekend, 25 on Saturday, 24 Sunday. Monday, partly sunny, a high of 26. Trishna? All right, thanks.